Hey guys, Shadow Phoenix here. Welcome back to the channel. And today I'm going to be playing a game that I've kind of had my eye on. Uh, this one is called Cloud Bunk. It is basically you play a delivery guy in like a Blade Runner Fifth Element type of world. Very, very steampunk. Um, I don't know if I'd really call it steampunk. I mean, maybe. Uh, just very futuristic. So to me, steampunk means a little something quite bit quite a bit different. I think this would more or less be cyberpunk. Yeah, cyberpunk. That that would be kind of what it is. Not to be confused with Cyberpunk 2077, which is coming out later this year, which I have got my eyes on as well. I can't wait to, to play that game. But, anywho, um, this game is from Ion Lands. It came out on April 23rd. Um, so I'm a little late to the party on this one, but it's getting rave reviews. Uh, the idea, and this is straight from the Steam page, it's a neon noir story in a rain-drenched cyberpunk metropolis. It's your first night on the job working for the Cloudpunk Delivery Service. Two rules. Don't miss a delivery and don't ask what's in the package. All right. And with that being said, uh, we're going to play this for maybe about, I think, probably about 30 minutes or so and just kind of get the hang of the game and, and kind of go from there. We'll see if this might actually become maybe a possible series here on my channel or if it's just more of a one-off, just kind of a let's play kind of thing. But uh, once we're all done with this, we will kind of we'll, we'll go over to the comment sections and stuff and kind of see what you guys think of it. Um, if you are enjoying this content, if you're liking my channel, if this is the first time you've ever been here, if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you hit that button down below the video that says subscribe it's red it's hard very very hard to miss and also click the notification bell that way you never miss a video of mine or a live stream that i do here on youtube either all right so let's go ahead and get started here in the game so new game i've already went through all the options and, and checked all that just to make sure everything is kind of set the way i want all right here we are Hmm. All right, so basically just like most racing games, left is brake, right is accelerate. I can steer with the left stick. Uh, I can go up and down with the right stick. Okay. All right, cool. So let's accelerate and move around the city here. I love the graphics on it. It's very pixelated. This is, wait, is this channel receiving? But yet it's still beautiful. 14 FC, this is control. We read you. Is that you, Carmine? No, my name is Rania. Oh, you're the new kid. I'm the new driver, yeah. Who is Carmine? He was driver 14FB. What happened to him? He, he retired last month. Good for him. Not really. Am I on, like, the freeway? Is that what that is? Last week. Lots of people got retired. Don't worry, you won't be flying through that section for hours yet. Where do I go now? Well, how are you handling your hava? Okay, I guess. I read your references. Oh! oh. You're a good That's driver, a building. But navigating a hava around Navalis isn't like driving your flat country roads back home. Now, this city goes down a hundred miles and up a thousand. Ooh. Remember, you're not driving an old internal combustion engine. How far can I go down? To engage your vertical repulsors or find one of the car lanes. I'm at the bottom. Flat this is as far down as I can go. I'll give you more instructions when you arrive. Thanks, Control. Uh, one more thing, 14 FC. Welcome to Cloudpunk. Okay, so they've given me something to do. So, all right, let's head... Pick up a payload at Cloudpunk HQ. Probably right there. It's 1,896 meters? Kilometers? Miles? I don't know. Inches? <laughs> we'll figure the map out later. Still trying to get the hang of driving this thing. We gas 200 meters. Wait, I have to worry about gas too. What kind of gas is this futuristic car use? 
I think the guy mentioned it a second ago, but actually, I think all he said was this is just this wasn't like a uh, regular car. I think is what he was trying to say. All right, well, we're almost there. Keep going. Lower Midtown. Oh, I just hit another car. Good thing I'm saving a bunch of money on my insurance. Can I go up outside of this? Yeah, I don't have to actually use an exit. I can just exit however I want. Okay, good. I'm glad there's no, like, space cops or anything in here. Because that would suck, wouldn't it? Let's see. Where am I where am I parking? Oh, I missed my parking lot. What? Where do you want me to go? Cloudpunk HQ. Okay. Park vehicle. Da 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 da! We have landed. Look at these little pixelated people. Oh wait, I'm a pixelated person! I can walk around to this is like GTA and cyberpunk kind of feel to it. All right, where am I going? In here? Nope, not in there. Over here? Over here. Pick up payload. 14 FC. This is going to the Marrow. Where's that? Pretty low in the city superstructure. I'll give you a waypoint on your navcom to help you find it. Be careful down there. It's busy and it's a maze. Not exactly the rich part of town. Okay. The kind of place where you wipe your feet on the way out. Okay. All right. Arminus was a great driver. He got big boots to fill. He flew delivery for over ten years. You know. How about the driver before him? Fourteen F A. Lasted one night. <laughs> Most drivers only last one night. They quit the job? One way or another. Yeah, you seem like a nice kid, 14 FC. I hope you make it. Don't get lost down there in the marrow. I'll try. What's in the package? That's not ominous at all. Kid. Don't miss the delivery and don't ask what's in the package. Everything else is just guidelines. I'm delivering drugs. All right, what, what's that here? Uh, uh. Oh, I went into the inner tubes. I'm now in the interwebs. All right, so looks like we're gonna go. Oh, that's a truck! Oh! They go up and also down, right? Yeah, that's about it. That sucked. You know why? No. Do I have like damage or anything that my vehicle takes? Not those again. Say again, 14 FC. Sorry, just making a kind of joke. Go ahead, control. Alphas are tuned to a vertical field frequency based on the layer of the city they're in. That field locks you to a maximum and minimum altitude. That's why you need the ascenders. They take you up or down the layer, and as they carry you, they reset your Hava's field frequency. They reset the vertical ceiling and floor. But Hava's fly just fine outside Novalis without vert fields. That's true. Your Hava will fly fine in areas without the fields. Well, that shut him up real quick, didn't it? <laughs> just go through one of the inner tubes. Even an old rune part the shoots. Of the city, it's the shoot the shoots. Grid, but the grid holds everything together in the city. Oh god, this I place is busy. Oh, access. there's so many traffic, so much traffic. The mapping systems, the reserve power if your engine stalls. And it stops us just flying straight up to the spire too, right? That's right, kid. The CEOs don't want you flying up and looking in their windows. They prefer their privacy. I guess we don't get many jobs up there anyway. You might be surprised, kid. Okay. So my delivery is down in here somewhere. Deliver payload to Irwin Carva in the Marrow. Find a place to park your vehicle. Is this anywhere? Oh, shoot.
Okay, I can't just park anywhere. I had to park in certain places. Over there's parking. I think. Okay, that worked. Alright, my character appeared right over here. There's merchants. Trixie Dio. I don't know if that's the person's name or her occupation. I doubt the other guy's name is actually Merchant. So. Uh, hello, Erwin Carver. I have your package. Oh, thank God. This will change everything. Where do I sign? Right here, Mr. Carver. What was that that happened in the background? I completely missed that. It's from my parents. They died, you know. Cora only knows what caused the crash. I'm sure they saved their whole life to give this to me. I, I thought it would be in cash. Limbs. But my neighbor said they'd probably leave me pressed gold. That way, you don't pay so much city tax on the transfers. Can I take that now? Sure. Here you go. Who is Cora? It's just an expression. Y you want to see what's inside? I can maybe give you a tip if it's limbs. Not every day you see someone become rich in front of your eyes, right? Just think. I can finally get the eye surgery I need. Two augments. No expense spared. I can hardly read the holocrons these days. It's all just a blur. Let's see. Just I know the feeling, Erwin. Right? I know that feeling. Oh. What is it? Gold? It's old toys. My ship models. The R7 ICBM and Sputnik. The NASA shuttles. The UN Interplanetary 101. Why did they send these? It must be some kind of code. There's a note, right? Yeah, let's see. Dear Irwin, we know these toys were important to you at one time. We need to sell the apartment, but your father has a scheme. It seems risky, but if all goes well, this will arrive just before we land at the colonies. We're going to the stars, just like we always dreamed. I know it's hard out there, but if we keep our heads down, we can start sending you money for the operations. More than enough money. Just hold on, honey. Everything's going to be okay. Sorry. Well, he did go. not get rich. Yeah. However, yeah, if it's anything like uh, like old Star Wars stuff and things, he can maybe sell those. Does eBay still exist in this universe? I'd totally put those things on eBay. Alright, how do we... How do we get back to my vehicle? Incoming call from Control. Good job, kid. I looked into your profile. It says you came from the Eastern Peninsula. Heard it's nice there. What made you want to come slumming with us in Novalis? It's the biggest city in the world. I wanted to make an impression. It's not easy to break out in Novalis, kid. Making it here is like trying to paint on the surface of a river. The current of people and ideas and the crowds, they, they wash everything away. I'll make it. Sure you will, kid. Just try making it through tonight first. We need you to head up to the Mercantile District. You're moving up in the world. What's the job? Same as always. Take a package from A to B without too many questions. A is a warehouse. B is a penthouse. Transmitting nav points now. And remember, don't let them look down on you, kid. The merchants are as far from the clouds as they are from the gutter. Okay, Control. On my way. Alrighty. Let's see. So where am I heading now? That way? That way. Load Hova AI. Load Assistant. Load Computer. Helper. Do you want to activate the generic automata? Yes, that's the one. Automata now available in generic limited mode. How can I help you today, sir? Not sir. My name is Rania. How can I help you today, Mr. Rania? I'm not <laughs> a mister. Update my profile, please. Profile <laughs> changes are... That's funny. Computers. Right? Computers. In the 
trial generic automata. Would you like to upgrade to my limited offer, monthly subscription, premium mode? Now, just how much to replace you with an existing AI? Do you have a hard copy of the AI on storage media? I do. Then the transfer cost to unlock the automata is 1,500 limbs, sir. How would you like to pay? Direct transfer. Please insert storage media. Transfer in process. Automata personality chemists will be activated in a process. I never told you to do that. Would you like to deactivate the generic automata personality now? Yes. Deactivating. Oh, Please great. There went the half the, automata. well, more than half the money I just made. Oh, I missed my spot. It's uh, somewhere down here. Is there only one parking spot? All right, down we go. I'm still trying to get the hang of driving this thing. Maybe I need to go up. I don't see it. Nope, it is not up. It is literally... Oh, wait. Over there somewhere. Store room clerk, that's probably who I had to see. Alright, so I need to find a parking place. The only parking place is way over here. That's annoying. Wait, 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 wait. I saw a parking place down there. Right there. There we go. Haha! -ha. Immediately transported over there. Can I run? I can walk. Alright, we go over here. Let's see storeroom clerk. Talk to. You the delivery driver? Yes, I'm from Cloudpunk. Cloudpunk? Alright, here's a package. Don't open it, don't ask me about it, and don't be late. And before you ask, yes, it's supposed to smell like that. Okay, thanks. Is this real meat? What did I just say? Alright, she's got a huge problem of not sticking to the rules, doesn't she? I could do this job. Come in, 14FC. How are you handling the hava so far? Hello, this is 14FC. Yes, everything is totally fine. Relax, kid, you'll get the hang of it. What's giving you the most trouble? The traffic? Yeah, and how fast everyone drives. They all know exactly where they're going. You'll be that fast once you get your bearings. Faster even. Just remember, the highways channel an induction loop through your hava. Right. It's pretty simple. When you're on the highways, it's like the road is moving under you. You'll get a big speed boost. Use the highways to get as close to your destination as you can and then cut off when you're close. I can only park in the bays, right? That's right. Havas aren't meant to touch the ground. The repulsors on the parking bays keep the undercarriage a few centimeters off the ground. It's not just a technical restriction. Corpse <laughs> I keep interrupting this guy as I go through the things. I'm sorry. I, they, the guy said not to be late. I'm trying to rush. Parking around the city to maximize traffic flow. I guess that's a good ah. thing for us. And them too. Ouch! The traffic jams seize up the wheels of commerce. If Corpsec have one priority, it's making sure... Oh, God! <laughs> <to be safe. laughs> Alright. It's a good thing I don't have to pay for repairs. Like, seriously. I also wish I could kind of drift a little bit. Maybe I can get upgrades. Okay, I just noticed there is a fuel thing on the side over there, so yes, you do have to fuel up on occasion. I missed my exit! Dang it. I'm Upper Midtown. Well, is it middle or upper? Alright. 
here we go. This is where I gotta go. <laughs> uh, okay. You would think this game would be a little boring, but it's actually not. It's kind of fun. Can I park over here? Yes. Yes, I can. I was going to say, wait, can I turn the camera or does the camera just turn on a cell? Hold cash. Is that like a bank or do I just give them cash and they hold it? Wait, that's the very definition of a bank. I guess I'm talking to you, butler. I have your delivery. Give it here. It says I'm to deliver to Mr. De Beer. That's my employer. Give it to me this instant. Hey, street rat. Has this been tampered with? What? No. Good. Most drivers ask what's in the package. Hmm. The smell makes them curious. What's in the package? Dinner. Meat. From which animal? What a strange question. Good day. From humans. It's human trafficking. Kinda. Alright, back to my thing. Job complete. I made a hundred bucks. Ooh, I'm getting rich. I'm getting rich real quick. Alright, I'm gonna need another delivery. Something that pays a little better than a hundred. Oh, inventory. Blue flower. Dried flower. See, are you back in Midtown yet? Yes. We messed up. We need you to get through a Corpsec security checkpoint. Now you've never been scanned by Corpsec. We just paid to wipe your record, so we need them to hold a clean file on you. They won't recognize me. <laughs> Not unless you've broken any other laws. Sending you a nav point now. Okay. Uh, one more thing, kid. You need to go through on foot, so don't look suspicious. Or act suspicious. Until Got it. Cloud Punk. Or me. I'm as high up as I can get right now. I can't go any higher. But I'm guessing this is where I gotta go. So parking is over here. Somewhere. Oops, missed the parking spot. This one looks like a fine parking spot right here. Park vehicle. Yeah, all right, let's do this. Corpse set guard, so I gotta go through here. Hold up, lady. Let's see either your citizen license or your voluntary contribution. I wish you people would just call them bribes. What's that? Nothing, officer. Here's my details. Okay. I just have to create a new record for you and then... Hold, please. I'm getting a message in my earpiece. Yes, Agent Rio. No, sir. Her name is Rania. Cloudpunk? I don't think so, sir. Yes, sir. I'll ask her. Yes, sir. I'll tell you if I think she's lying. Ma'am. Are you now, or have you at any time been a part of the illicit delivery service known as Cloudpunk? Never heard of them. Hold, please. Yes, sir. She says she's never heard of them. I believe her, sir. Okay, sir, I'll let her through. And I'll... She can hear me. Hmm? Hmm? Yes. Yep. Okay, then. I'll do that. Sir, yes, sir. Okay, miss, you can go. Your details have been updated. When I scanned your ID, our server said you're a musician from the Eastern Peninsula. Wanna play us some music? Maybe another time. <laughs> okay. Right, okay, so I went through here. What now? Life Corp. Hmm. Let's see, that makes me think, seeing that and the guy talking about the implants and stuff, made me think of a movie. Uh, Repo Man. Have you guys ever seen Repo Man? 
It's got uh, Giles from Buffy in it. It's quite good. It's like this really funky like musical. It's it's interesting. Yeah. Return to my vehicle. Okay. Just thought I'd walk around a little bit in this seedy hotel area here with the bars and stuff. Because, you know, why not? Uh, sorry, no time to play a song for you. Not today. I need to hurry back. I got more deliveries and more money to make. Where's my vehicle? Is it? Yeah, that's it. Up we go. Your automata custom personality is ready for instantiation. Would you like to activate Camus now? Yes. Yes. Please. Are you there? It's you. I missed you. How are you? Happy. Why am I? Feels strange. You've been loaded into my vehicle's automata slot. Oh. Reminds me of the so dog guess, from Up. This is all I can afford Squirrel! Right now. <laughs> I was a bad dog? No, you were the best, Camus. I am just a hobo now. Not as good. I know, I know. We'll get you a new body, I promise. It will just take a while. I have a new job. You don't play music anymore? I like music. Me too, Camus, but we need money. We lost the house. I had to move us to Novalis. Oh no. We hate the city. We did. Maybe it's not so bad now. I'm doing deliveries. We are doing deliveries. I am helping. Yeah, <laughs> I am helping. We're a team, right? I Squirrel! Help. I feel not so good though. I am sleepy now. It's the automata slot in the Hova car. It's pretty limited, and the hardware runs at a lower clock cycle, so you might need to take it easy for a while. Don't understand. Your higher operating functions are multi-threaded, but that's not supported with the hardware we have. Uh... That means it might take you a bit longer to figure things out. But you'll get there. I'm sleepy. Okay, rest for now, Camus. I'll bring you online soon. And Camus, I missed you too. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Who's a good car? <laughs> uh, all right, let's see. What now? Give me another mission. I'm just kind of sitting here. There we go. Incoming call from control. We sent someone else. We need you to. Damn it! Sorry. We need you to pick up a package from Cambria Heights. It's a residential zone. I'm sending a nav point now. Okay, okay. on my way. Wait. 14 FC. Is there a problem? No, never mind. Good luck. That doesn't sound good. Again, foreshadowing and being ominous. You know, this game could have really, like, sewed the rights to, like, advertising and stuff. There could be advertising all over the place, just like in, uh, in Blade Runner. Should be, like, a giant Atari symbol somewhere. She's <laughs> like, Atari's still gonna be around in, like, the year 2049. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's see. Where are we going? Looks like I need to get off on this exit. Oops. There went my antenna. It's okay. Happens to the best pilots. Uh, let's see. Parking? Parking's way over here. There it is. Boop. Down we go. Man, this game makes me really want to play Cyberpunk 2077. Control, I'm at the destination and no one is here. Control, Camus, are you awake? Yes, I am awake. Excited. Want to help. Can you scan the area? 
Local scan. Look for ID chips on possible delivery containers. I don't know how. Wait, I know how. I think. What is box? A box is a square cube. No, what is that box? It's right there. Okay, I see it. I guess that's the package then. Why is no one here? I have bad feelings. Me too, Camus. I got a bad feeling about this. How do I get to it? What box? What? Oh, that box. Alright. Run. Something's gonna happen here. I have a feeling. I have a feeling bad things are gonna happen. I like the dog's interpretation, though. Is <laughs> the uh, the thing? It's pretty cool. It's exactly how I imagine a dog talking. I hear noise. What noise, Camus? Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. From the package. I hear it too. I still have. Oh, feeling. someone's ordered a clock from Amazon. Control, come in. Control, this is driver fourteen FC. Come in. This is important. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Please deliver your current package with urgency. Control, why is this package ticking? You don't think she should have to do this? Call me. I thought you would tell her. Control, what's happening there? Uh, nothing. I've been informed that you're to stop calling us about the package. Deliver it quickly. That is all. Please, no more communication until delivery. Camus, I don't know what to do. I am nervous. Why? I am nervous because you are nervous. Maybe we can throw away the TikTok. No, they gotta get their clock. TikTok, TikTok. Maybe I could dump it at the trash chute in Section 8B. That says Harry it Potter, the, the mysterious ticking the noise. City. Nothing ever comes back from there. Will Mr. Control be mad? Yes, but I get a bad feeling too, Camus. I think it will be bad either way. I want to help, but don't know what to do. I know, Chemist. I know. I just have to make okay. a call on this one. Next exit. This seems fine. Let's do this exit. Maybe I should have stayed on a highway. Oh! Metro Hub. There it is. Where, is there parking here? I don't see any parking. Oh. Where's the parking? Oh, what's up? You have to think three-dimensional for this. Over here. There. Down we go. All right, we let's see what happens with this, and then we'll probably call this episode uh, an episode, I suppose. Drop package in this. Oh, maybe I. I won't drop it in here. I guess it was nothing. We did our job, Camus. We shouldn't ask so many questions. I am not sure. You want to say something? If it is okay? Sure. Is this a job good? It pays good. Are we doing good things? No more questions, please, Chemist. Okay. Cool. We just dropped a bomb. Well, that's okay, because the bomb just got dropped on us. <laughs> Alright. So, I think that will do us for this episode. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I will maybe be back with another episode of this, and uh, it just kind of depends on you. Do you guys want to find out what happens in the rest of this game? Uh, or whatever. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you want to see a continuation of this, uh, or should we go on to other games? Anywho, I'm out. Wherever you guys are in the world, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Thanks for watching.